The spam is on! Alright guys, it's another difference for Pit. HMK is back, let's check it out. Alright guys, so Pit, uh, he wasn't in Melee first of all, he was only here in Brawl, one of the big names in Brawl. So let's take a look at him in Brawl. Alright, so we got the staple 1 2 hit, 1 2 3 combo, or it can be done into a continuous buzzsaw type deal. It's very useful, you know, I like to spam a lot. Alright, the side uh, strong, you know, double pokey. The side strong down is a ground sweep. And the strong up is the freaking double kick. Now a side smash is a double hitter similar to Link's double chop. But you know it has more control in the area. It doesn't push him forward or anything you know. The, pull, the first slash pulls you in and the second slash pulls you out. Then we have the ground sweep. And the smash up. The triple hitter just like Link's. Pit's uh, slashes are pretty similar to Link but you know not really. Alright so the forward. I mean the neutral. A is a uh, windmill. The first, the forward A is a is a regular slash. Now the back A is I like to call the elbow slash. You know, it's because it's kind of like him hitting you with elbow, but not really. He's hitting you with the back of the blade. All right, the up arrow is a up windmill. The down one is a down slash. Even though it looks like it has meter smash capability, this doesn't have it. You know, it's good for floating, but yeah. Now we have the light arrow, Pit's signature move, you know, he is an archer, you know, they decided to turn his bow into blades when they turned him into a smash character. Now this one, his side B is a continuous windmill, it has reflective capabilities and you can, you know, hold it as long as you don't get hit, you can continuously doing it, no problem. Alright, now his up uh, special is his uh, Wings of Icarus allows him to fly for an extended period of time. You know, that's pretty broken. He has like five jumps and that. Jesus Christ. But you know, Pit's Pit. Now, oh, and I also like to mention, I show you, I showed you his down uh, special a while back. It was the Mirror Shield, you know, speaks for itself. <clears throat> so now the running attack we have is the running slash. You know, not too, not too bad. Now we have the down throw, the side throw, come here Yoshi, the uh, back throw, and the up throw. You know, nothing too special, Pit's throws are like, eh. Pit mostly relies on this, uh, of the power of the blades, you know, keep on spamming until your opponent is a high health, and then whammo. Now we have his three taunts, you know, the spam is on, you're not ready yet, and his, you know, stretching his angel wings. You know, getting ready for the fight. All right, Yoshi, latest. All right, let's take a look at Pit in Project M. Now, Project M, Pit has been changed a bit. You know, not really his regular A moves, as you can see here. His uh, one, two, three combo and his windmill combo is still there. He's been changed a lot with his specials, and I'm about to show you that uh, when we get to that bridge. All right, so we still have the side strong. You know, double poke the side down. It's a bit slower than the last time. The side the strong up which is the double kick is a bit faster than the last time which is weird the double chop smash side we also have the smash down the ground sweep the smash up which is a triple slash triple slash slashy 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 anyways <clears throat> now his neutral a windmill it has you know back in brawl it kept going but it stops after like four spins now we still have the elbow slash and the front aerial, which is a regular slash. The same thing with the up windmill, it spins like three times, I think, and that's about it. It doesn't continue spinning. We also have the down swipe, which looks like it has a bit more reach, which is weird in this game. We also have the light arrows, still control it, whatever you want. Yeah, light arrows. Now this is weird. His side B is like a dive type deal, where he automatically goes into a glide mode. And which takes up his, you know, third uh, special jump. But it's good, I mean, if you're like high in the air and you need to get back to the field. But it's weird that they replace his B side with that. I mean, I guess that spamming shit was really getting on people's nerves. But whatever. Down we still have the mirror shield. But in this game, you can't turn around all the way. I mean, wherever you're facing, you're going to be stuck there. Now, his B up is weird. Instead of the Winds of Icarus, he kind of like thrust his shields upwards and it gets you a little bit of height but 
not really the height is not really good I mean he still has his five jumps or whatever now we still have his running his running animation has been changed a little bit but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna include it into the main differences because it's just a running animation now let's see we still have all the throats the throw <laughs> sorry the throws intact I have the down the side up yeah all the throws are there you know fucking up Luigi only way I know how yeah now let's see what else um I think it's time for Luigi to go bid by oh not yet uh, his wave dashing now Pitt's wave dashing is pretty good in this game you know it's pretty fair it's pretty quick however is a good distance but it's kind of you know hard to pull off because Pitt he's a relatively high jumper for his first jump so it's kind of hard to pull off but once you get down you're good all right there Luigi oh that reminds me I forgot to do his taunts all right all the taunts have been there they haven't been changed so it's not really a big of a deal if I forgot them yep that's all for now that's Pitt for Brawn Project M. Until next time, I have been HMK and I'll check you guys later.